Hi everyone, I'm Randy Pierce, founder and president of 2020 Vision Quest and author of See You at the Summit. Like many of us, I'm profoundly impacted by COVID-19 personally and professionally. The keynote presentations I provide have been canceled or postponed, and that's why I'm reaching out in this form, because I want to give a motivational message to all the folks who I've presented to in the past and may present to in the future. When I first lost my sight, that journey to total blindness was difficult because going blind is harder than being blind. And in that journey, I felt helpless and hopeless and was resultingly just those things. But as soon as I changed my mindset, as soon as I started focusing not on the lost opportunities that went with my loss of sight, but on all of the opportunities which still existed, when I focused on the fact that I still had vision even though I lost my sight, I began to find a positive momentum and I began to climb in the direction I want to do. So to get us all in a positive step this week, I want to share that message of accountability that I learned at that early stage of my life. Right? We are accountable for the decision in how we respond to any adversity, and that's important. But we're also rewarded by the choice that we make. So at a time like this, it's important to consider that we can be leaders in a crisis rather than people who bow to the crisis and get run over by that crisis. We can lead the people around us. We can lead our companies. We can lead the peers of our organization to also take that accountability step to understand what opportunities still exist, whether it's to learn a new technology that will help them work in these environments better, whether it's to learn how to communicate with their peers in a different fashion to reach better success. The first step in positive momentum is to have an understanding that we are accountable for the choice we make and that that choice will bring us reward. So take that first step and spring into action with me and be a leader in this time of crisis.